I'm Lauren Cornish. I'm originally from Baltimore, Maryland, and I, I, uh, I do art. I, 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 I make things out of, out of things. I make things out of things. That's what I do. I, I take things that I find, like this particular wood here is from, from houses that have gone bad in Baltimore, and I've taken the wood from them to give new life to houses that once had life, you know. When I was in California and I started doing, doing art, I started with a whole bunch of crosses. And then I started doing words like trust and love and believe. Because I do words because they inspire me. I'll look up and I'll see the word believe. And then that just gives me another minute to, you know, another hour or another second to, to keep believing. So that's why I use a lot of words because they encourage me, they, they inspire me, they lift me up because a lot of times being an artist, you're alone. Art comes out of my worship. The reason I do art is because I wanted to find a way where I could actually stay home all day and worship God. <laughs> and so out of my worship came this stuff, you know, it came something to do. Thinking about the future, thinking about what people think, um, trying to impress or or sell, you know, or, or hope they like this, and takes away from the moment of creating for me. This piece represents us as a people, black people, building America. And if you can see, there's the hammer in this guy's hand. He has this oversized head, these oversized lips, and these incredible features, these shoulders, and these arms, and this huge mass of body, and huge legs and, and very, very dark skin. And, and, it, and it shows the, the strength of us as a people. And the colors on the inside of this piece shows the diversity of who we are. But see, the people who chose us to, to build their country only saw us as silhouettes. That's all they saw. They just saw a silhouette. They didn't see how deep we were as a people. Well, I, sometimes I'm doing my work. I try to think, is there any place else that I really want to be right now? And all the time, the answer is no. I want to be right where I am. I want to be doing exactly what I'm doing. I want to be worshiping God, listening to my music, and doing my art. I mean, there's nothing else that could possibly, possibly, make me happier.